What's up YouTube? This is Prince today TP101 and Apple has just released iOS 10.2.1. So overall I'm gonna have some good news and I'm gonna have some bad news regarding the whole 10.2 to 10.2.1 jailbreak and the whole the whole work. So Apple just released 10.2.1 right here to the public and there's no new features in 10.2.1 different from 10.2 it's basically the same thing there's a lot of bug fixes and all that kind of stuff but if you're on 10.2 and you want a jailbreak I would suggest that you stay there if you're on 10.2 on your iPhone 6s and below on 64 bit I would suggest that you stay this is my iPhone 6s right here so I would suggest that you stay on 10.2 it will give you the prompt to update but don't update so I'll go to about you can see where is it? You can see right there. Let's turn the brightness down on the screen. As you can see right there, I'm on 10.2 on my iPhone 6 because I'm waiting for that 10.2 jailbreak. But if you're on iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, supposedly the 10.2 jailbreak won't work for for the iPhone 7 and 7 Plus. But just to be safe, I would stay on 10.2 even if you're on the 7 or 7 plus right now I'm on the 10.2.1 but I will be downgrading back to 10.2 soon as I'm done this video because at the moment I, Apple is still assigning 10.2 for all firmware so if you wanna keep your jailbreak or if you wanna be um, jailbroken when the next jailbreak is released do not update to 10.2.1 because there's no new features it's just a lot of bug fixes and all that kind of stuff. So if you are a jailbreaker, stay away from 10.2.1. If you don't care about jailbreaking, you just want to be on the latest firmware because I mean it's more stable. So you could update. If you don't care about jailbreak, then you definitely could update. Just do the whole prompt, go to settings, and update that way. Okay, so time for the, the jailbreak update. So Luca Tedesco, the guy who released the 10.1.1 jailbreak, he recently tweeted out that after he released the 10.2 jailbreak he will stop all iOS research all that kind of stuff at least publicly I don't know if he's gonna be doing it in the background like like secretly and then he just pops up and say hey I got a jailbreak but I won't release it he might do it like that just do it personally on his in his spare time but he won't do anything official after the 10.2 jailbreak whenever he releases it he didn't say when but it should be released anytime now if if he doesn't change his mind yeah and the reason he's gonna do that is basically because a lot of people been bugging him just tweeting at him constantly and he, basically he's frustrated right now he just basically said the people are just are idiots basically that's what he's saying I mean they just bug him and bug him and bug him and now he's just frustrated so after this he's just gonna stop all public research of iOS but who knows what he'd be doing he might do it privately or I mean then just 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 like I said so he recently tweeted that out if you follow me on Twitter I, re, I t retweeted it so definitely follow me on Twitter the link in the description but yeah that's what he said after this 10.2 jailbreak so the jailbreak is coming for 10.2 he did say it won't support 10 it won't, it won't support the iPhone 7 and 7 plus but if you have an iPhone 7 or 7 plus like I do keep your fingers crossed I mean he might just he might he might find a way to add them in before it's released so if you're into that definitely look forward to that but if you're on iPhone 6s or 6s plus and below on 64 bit definitely stay on 10.2 because that's what he's gonna release the jailbreak for so yeah there you go guys that's just a brief rundown of today's event and there's no 10.3 beta 1 I've been checking and I'm in the beta program and there's no 10.3 beta 1 so I thought it would be out by now but maybe it's coming tomorrow on a Tuesday usually Apple release most of their betas on Tuesday for some reason so hopefully it comes tomorrow and also Apple did release Mac OS Sierra update 10.12.3 and they also released an update for the Apple Watch which is the 
let's see what that is so basically all their products have been updated even the Apple TV so there's also a new update for that so let me go ahead and download and install this so yeah there you go guys I just wanted to update you guys on what's going on if you want to jailbreak stay away from 10.2.1 it's Prince with ATP 101 rate comment subscribe share peace thanks for watching